welcome back to our Chase the Ace career mode, and uh, we've got through the transfer window. We're almost, uh, I think there's three days left. I'll see if I can make uh, maybe one more transfer. Um, there's not a lot out there that I really want to bring in. I haven't found enough high-rated players, so um, we'll, we'll see how we go. We've got a little bit of money still to play with, uh, but we sit top of the table after that outstanding win in the first game. Uh, of the season, so uh, hopefully it is a sign of things to come. Helsinki, we'll just keep an eye on as well because uh, they've won their first game unconvincingly, just the one nil. But three points is three points, and uh, well, the race is well and truly on. Let's jump into this one with a player upgrade. Right, today's player upgrade is for Holanda, and um, this one comes from Ryan Fitzgerald. Thank you very much for your comment. Eleven thumbs up at the time of recording this video. Uh, he said, "Keep the number." So that is the number nine. A long sleeve undershirt, red boxing tape on both hands, black ankle tape, high socks, and keep the boots. Well, Holanda got off to an incredible start. Uh, yeah, good, good mate there, Pete reckons we should be calling him Zoolander. So uh, we'll see what happens through this season if he makes a name for himself. But uh, let's jump into this episode, see if there's any more signings. And of course, we'll have some games. Let's do this. All right, so I have made a signing here for the reserves team. And uh, it is a Brazilian right back, Claris Farias. Um, 99 acceleration, 93 sprint speed. So he's got some rapid pace. We need to work on his defensive uh, attributes. Five foot seven, medium defensive work rate. He is a speedster. Uh, could possibly be uh, one of the uh, superior regens. I'm not too sure. Brazilian right back. Maybe you guys can let me know who possibly is. But uh, that is a decent pickup. And uh, it's really just the left back position uh, that we seem to be struggling in at the moment. But uh, there's just not any out there higher than a, a 71 that I've found so far. So, um, yeah, we'll push on. Uh, possibly need a better backup keeper, but uh, we'll see how Christos does go. Maybe he will develop a little bit more. Um, yeah, I'm going to see what else is floating around before this transfer window is done. We still need to uh, offload Cissé. Uh, and Fortunus, so uh, might be a little bit more cash there to play with if we can offload those two players. Right, we sold one Aguilar uh, to QPR for three and a half million. Well, it is transfer deadline day. We've got an offer in here for Cissé from Ajax for 14 and a half. We'll accept that offer. And we offload Cissé with three hours to go in the window. Let's see how much money we have to play with and see if we can sneak one more player into this squad. Right, I've managed to uh, swing a little bit of a purchase here. It's cost me 52 million for the left winger in Diaz Fernandez. Uh, but I can tell you right now, it's the Cristiano Ronaldo regen. I think this is the first time I've ever picked him up in uh, any of the series. He's already got incredible acceleration, jumping and sprint speed. Of course, he can play up front. The lovely low, low work ranks that we expect uh, from FIFA, but he's got the five-star weak foot. That's fine. Shit skill moves. That's fine. I don't use skill moves very often anyway. He's a dribbler and an acrobat. And, well, we really needed a left winger coming in. So uh, that really helps out the first team. And uh, this team is looking pretty solid. Uh, we probably just need to uh, train a little bit more into the left-back position now. And that first team is looking very formidable. A decent bench as well. Uh, so Zambo does move to the bench. But, I mean, that's a decent striking option. Holanda and uh, Zambo. And then we've got Butter, Petrovic, Selesnev, Feargiver. Oh, it's just a star-studded lineup. And even all the young lads still coming through, still growing. Uh, unfortunately, I don't think we're going to get rid of Fortunus. Um, we might have to offload him in the next window. Right, a quick look uh, with one hour to go in the transfer window. And uh, HK Helsinki have offloaded Edwards and Busquets and brought in Joyce and Chong. Uh, I'm not sure who those two lads are, but definitely losing Edwards and Busquets uh, might hurt their... Their season, although Vieira is probably playing in the same position as Butz gets, and I'm not sure who they've got playing on the right-hand side now if Edwards is out. But, uh, oh well, we'll scout Joyce and Chong so we can uh, keep an eye on their team. All right, the transfer window is shut, and uh, we can get our season underway. We need to be very selective with uh, of these youth players that we do bring in. and They're going to have to be of a decent overall rating uh, to be worth bringing in as well as a, a decent potential. So um, we'll just monitor these lads. I mean, Coesta, 92 to 94, but he's only 57. He needs time to grow, and uh, unfortunately, even that potential, he might not have time to make it into this career mode. Um, so we'll just monitor their progress, see how they're going, and uh, obviously release anyone that we feel is not going to make the cut and um, yeah we'll just push on obviously some of these lads are already 18 and uh, are going to want contracts we're going to be still scouting maybe bring in some new youth talent I don't know what's going to happen this season I'm hoping that we can go through and beat Helsinki to the Bundesliga title let's get into it
Right, time for the second game of the season. Diaz Fernandez will get his debut here. Uh, we go with Holanda, Diaz Fernandez, Roldan, Azevedo, DeWitt and Murillo in the midfield. Costi, Guedes, Pereira, Cueros, and Malay at right back. Wolf is between the sticks. And uh, yeah, come on, let's get another three points and roll this season over. All right, here we go. I think this is match day number two here in the Bundesliga. It is match day two. Olympiacos at home in the Karazi Karkis Stadium hosting Ajax. Now, uh, well, we are the league leaders. We've got some fresh faces into this team. And uh, let's see if Holanda can uh, be a merman up the front. And Zavato drives forward, lead away by our former player in Cissé. Murillo to Costi. Malay looks like he's picked up an injury. Diaz Fernandez plays this one forward. Roldan turns his man. And where the fuck was that going, Roldan? He's turned back, but... Oh, that is disgraceful. Malay is struggling to go here with Plyvet. Play back inside. Good work there from Young Costi. Murillo plays it out wide, and here's Diaz Fernandez. 99 pace, and he's getting run down. No, he isn't. He's going alone. Let's go, Diaz Fernandez. Cuts back inside. Still comes Diaz Fernandez. He'll slip this one forward. He'll land up. Great save by Van Leer. Good from Roldan. He'll land up, lays it off. Azevedo makes the push. It's Azevedo. Oh, sidebar. Costi plays it forward, finds Roldan. Roldan strikes, but Van Leer has it coming. And there is the whistle. A tough contest in first half, and it's nil all. Holanda down the line. Here's Diaz Fernandez. Flicks it through now. Here is Holanda. Can he get the finish? No, safe. From Murillo, Diaz Fernandez. Roland back off for Diaz Fernandez. Shouldn't have the pace to take this man on Diaz Fernandez, but just gets leveled. There's a ball for DeWitt. Oh, lovely vision from DeWitt. Holanda turns his man, takes this. Oh my days, what a save from Van Leer. Not sure what rating this keeper is, but he's been very good today. They bring on to Cilio. We've got a quarter in the 65th minute. Azevedo delivers in, looks for big roll down. Oh, who is this fucking keeper? Well, we'll make our changes. Zambo, Butter, and Selesnev check in for Fernandez, David, and roll down checking out. Oh, lovely work from Selesnev. You'll get a run on here from Zambo, but picked off. Somehow he gets through. Here's Murillo. He'll play it off. Holanda lays it off. It's, I can't believe it's not Butter. Oh, picked off. Good defensive play. Ajax have been very good defensively. Maybe we shouldn't have sold them Cissé. Cuts back inside nicely. Still comes Selesnev. He's going to need a bit of help here, is he? Decides to take Cissé on himself. Has to cut back. Lays it off. He's got Butter. Butter turns. Can he deliver? No, he can't. Great defense. He set something up here. To cut back, drives it inside for Selesnev. Great save, Zambo. Yeah, it's a late goal, but we'll take it in the 89th minute. Zambo and Guiza gets us the goal. We fight our way forward to find three points. Good save again, but finally we swoop in like a seagull on a hot ship. And Zambo off the sidebar made it a little bit difficult for himself. He probably should have gone for the left post. He's managed to find the back of the netting. It's 1-0, Olympiacos. And there is the whistle. We hold off the final attack for a 1-0 victory. Well, 12 shots to four, 17 tackles. It was uh, a tough, contested encounter. Zambo checks in and gets a man of the match, 8.3. How many fucking saves? Seven there for Van Leer. And, um, yeah, not a bad performance. We probably need to be surging forward a little bit more. Uh, we'll find some momentum this season. Don't you worry about that. Let's roll on. Right, Ivar have put in an offer here for Brent Thighs. It's 8.6. It's above his evaluation. He's not getting any game time, and we will accept. And I've managed to sell Fortunus on to Galatasaray for 10.9 million. He'll be leaving in the January window. Right, we do have the Euro League this season. I am going to be simulating these games, unless, of course, we make the final. But the reserves team can get the job done here, hopefully, and uh, get themselves some minutes so that they don't whinge and bitch that they're not getting any game time. Uh, it's a 1 1 draw. Right, game number two for us. We are, uh, well, look who it is. It's HJK Helsinki. We are away at the Telia 5J Arena. And uh, we'll get a real good opportunity here to see how Helsinki are tracking. They've got promotion and uh, looking okay. The first team is ready for action. 
Let's get into this. So here we go, our first crack at the ace side this season. But to be fair, we have probably been the better club over the last two seasons. It's good to see that Helsinki have finally made that jump. And uh, we'll get a good look at how they are playing now and what kind of team they're putting out on the park. Um, I'm going to pause it just because I don't want to get done for any uh, copyright infringements. So we, uh, we'll have a quick look here at the player rating so we can see the Helsinki sign. They go with Zuri and Durdovic up front. Foden, uh, Vieira, Davies. Now, Jay Smith over there on the right-hand side, I think he's the American. He's at about an 80 rated. Uh, Schneider, Pierre, Foyth, Martinek, and Dragowski goes in as the keeper. I'm not sure why they're playing Dragowski over Rossi. Um, but you know what? Maybe he's the man in form. Uh, let's get into this game and see if we can uh, get over Helsinki. And there's Avedo. Just drives his way forward and rolled in. Has an opening. Dragowski called into action inside 90 seconds. And we'll get a corner. Stretching them out. Rolled in. Murillo. Plays it back forward. Rolled in. Needs to flick on. He's got Helena. And Dragowski with the save. We are threatening. Acevedo plays it forward, knows the land, has got the pace to burn. Drives his way in forward, cuts back nicely, lays it off. Acevedo, Dragowski with the save. Diaz Ferreira, oh my days, Dragowski. He has found some touch here. There's Diaz Fernandez, we know he has no skill moves. Drives his way forward for Murillo. Inside now, here's David. And he gets picked off. Only as far as Costi though. We'll drive one down the line. Diaz Fernandez tries to bring it inside. It was a poor touch. Vieira picks it off, and here is Foden. Now wide for Smith. Back to Foden. Down the line for Smith. And he drives the line. Big ball over the back. As Avedo. Oh, great save from Wolf. Great save from Wolf. He's keeping us in the game here. Helsinki look hungry. Dudovic looking to score against his former club. As Avedo. A big roll down. Oh, ref blows the whistle. Well, it's all been Helsinki. We've had a few cracks at Dragowski, but it's nil all. Oh, great save from Wolf. Helsinki starting to put a little bit of a clinic here together with their passing. And they've got a corner in the 51st minute. They drive it inside. Malay gets up and clears it away, but Davis will bring it back in. Jury. Davis. And the wolf is there to protect the dead. Oh, what a goal by Helsinki. And that makes it 1-0. It's Jury getting the goal. That is a brilliant finish from Jury. Wolf finally beat it. 54 minutes. Helsinki have looked quality today, that is for sure. And uh, that is a decent ball inside there. I think it's from Djurnovic. Completely unmarked, and he's just volleyed at home. Oh, what is our defenders doing? Fucking ballet. One nil. Must be rolled in. Drives his way through. Wants Holanda, who gets the steal. Works his way inside. Holanda, Dragowski with the save. Well, Durdovic checks out for Helsinki, and we'll bring on Butter. Good ball from Rolled in. Here's Fernandez, shoots one forward. He's got Holanda. Oh! Oh, and he's injured as well! You're having a laugh, son. All right, let's make the changes. Zambo and Fear give a check in for Holanda and Azevedo. And we've got the corner. Fear give it to deliver. He's brought rain with this one. Oh! Who got up? It was Pereira Caleros who's missed. He's the Fear giver. He drives it in for Zambo, who can't get up. They've brought on Chong. Who is Chong? Look at his fucking hair. Murillo. Get in, son. Fear giver with the corner. Oh! And there we go. First blood has been drawn by HKK Helsinki. We lose one goal to nil. Well, 12 shots to seven. We had the tackles, but they have the goal. And uh, unfortunately, we just could not find... Helander or Zambo. Zambo only got a 5.6 checking in late, but um, oh, that's that's a little bit rough. Jury gets an 8.7 man in the match there for Helsinki. Right, just the two games for you in this one. We will start getting to three games, hopefully, if we have the time. 
Um, let's do a player upgrade though. We're going to upgrade Diaz Fernandez, the Cristiano Ronaldo regen. Uh, if you want to make any changes to his number or his kit, let me know in the comment section. And of course, the one with the most uh, thumbs up on their comment gets the upgrade in the future episode. Good luck. Right, so let's do a quick squad report here and uh, let's just check on how the team is looking since the transfer window is shut. Uh, we've got uh, Marit 67 up. Let's, let's hang on, let's get rid of all the loan offers. List uh, potential to be special is uh, Marich, Stipe, Marich 67 up one. We've got Christos is 68, Wolf is an 88 up one, Lupu uh, 71 up one. Uh, we've just picked up Yanel Rakoa, Cleveris Farias 78 up one, Malay is an 80 up two, uh, White Lone listed 65 up one and has the potential to be special. Uh, Pereira, Cueros an 82 up one, Guedes 84 up one, Sabukwe is a 64 up one, and an exciting prospect. Uh, Korniakis 64 up one, we'll remove him from the loan list now, he is an exciting prospect. Uh, we brought back Ricardo Galano for a 77, Palace is an exciting prospect at 75, Cosmichu an exciting prospect at 68. Uh, left back, we've got Costi 71 up two, Kaya 70 up one, uh, Perez 71 up one. Central defensive midfield on loan is uh, Top Knot Jackson. He is at Newcastle. Uh, Benito Arneas is a 67 up one. Dunphy a 66 up one. Murillo 80 up one. At right midfield, we've got Morgan Roberts 71 up two. Fear Giver an 84 up one. Mitchell 75. Uh, Thighs has been approached by Ibar. That deal still looking like it might go through is a 74. Mazua 77 up one. As a Beto, we paid 85 million to get him back to the club. He's an 85 overall. Uh, Dragic out on loan, 76 up one. Alexopoulos out on loan, 69 up one. A lot of right midfielders. In the midfield, we've got Kelvin Batter, 79 up two. Petrovic, 79 up one. Uh, Carvajal, 71 up one. Arnea, 68 up one. Mike DeVitt, 83 up one. Ostergaard, 75 up one. Is a left midfielder, our only one at the club. Uh, central attacking midfield, Fortunas will be going to Galatasaray. Selesnev is an 81 up one. Morgan, 72. Sartsitakis is on the loan at Millwall, 69 up one. Magellan, a 77 up one a center forward. We've got Roldan up to an 82. Zupan, a 73 up one. Zambos, an 84 up one. Holanda, an 85 up one. Uh, Diaz Fernandez, we've just brought in for 52 million, is an 81 overall. Uh, Dangbo, 75 up one. Limpis out on loan is a 77. So that's our squad. It's looking fairly decent. Uh, a little bit more training, and uh, we could have a quality side. But uh, Helsinki have just touched us up, so um, yeah, we've got a bit of work to do. So we finish up this episode with not all teams have played their four games, so Bayern Munich are on top at the moment. Helsinki in third there with the seven points, and uh, we've slipped to sixth with six points. Only early days in this season. Uh, we'll definitely have some more games for you moving through this season. But the race is on, boys. Helsinki are above us now. Uh, game on. We'll see you in the next one. I'm Sparring DK. It's 5 o'clock somewhere, and you have a good one.